Sometimes it's necessary to strike first, Cleopatra. It's well you did so. You're not shocked? Shocked? <laughs> Such things as this are not strange to me. Open negotiations with the Egyptian generals. Send them his head. Your Majesty, I was not expecting to see you. You idiot! Why did you let Cleopatra get past you? Alert your warships to set sail for Alexandria. We march it for his life. Come on. Forgive me, Imperator. Our sinewy is gone. Ptolemy, too. They both vanished from the city. They've gone to Pelusium. To Ptolemy's army, to drive us both out of Alexandria. Assemble my staff at once. We must defend here, here, and here. I'll need more men. Reinforcements are days away. We must hold the harbor. Otherwise, the enemy will smash our fleet. Caesar, the Egyptians are on the march. They will attack by land and sea. The enemy's numbers are too great. We cannot hold. We will lose all. Abandon the harbor. We let them into the city. But there is no way out. If we lose, you lose your empire. This battle does not have to be fought. Return to Rome, Caesar. You have no choice. No. If we fight within the walls of the city, we can trap them. All streets lead to the palace square. Destroy them there, Caesar. You read my mind, Cleopatra. There is always choice, Rufio. We will fight them in the streets. And when victory is within the palm of their hands, we will strike with all our might. My countrymen, you and I have risked all before and won. Now we raise the stakes. The prize is Egypt. 